everybody, welcome back to another episode of Infiltration. So I got a bit of a surprise for you guys today. Um, as you notice, we've gone past the financial report. I was going to do a mission before that or do a couple of missions before that, but I thought this particular episode we want to try something new. So let's go to the mech base and I'll show you what I've done here. So the Atlas uh, 2C has now been outfitted and it is not what we talked about. It is not an MM, a heavy MML, uh, uh, MRM build, I mean. Um, it's something completely different and I thought I would try it just to see how it works out. So let's have a quick look at this guy. Um, it's a beast and what I did was I dropped in a rotary autocannon 20 in one arm and a rotary autocannon 10 in the other arm. So we've got plenty of rack ammo for the 20. This thing jams really really fast. So um, as a recoil of four jam chances recoil times 40 percent so we've got minus two recoil here and that's it so it's got an 80 percent chance to jam minus the pilot's recoil which i think it, we're going to put it give it to gun doll so he's got minus two recoil so it should be hopefully has a zero percent chance of jamming fingers crossed but we'll see that on the other side we've got the uh rack 10 uh which the chance of jamming is a little lower it has a uh, five misfire multiplier uh, recoil uh, times multiplier equals misfire chance is recoil of five so four for the uh, every recoil of four it'll have a recoil of two because of the pilot so I'm really hoping that this thing doesn't uh, misfire so we'll have to be careful of that uh, so we have some pretty heavy firepower here and then for when these things aren't functioning we have a pair of medium lasers and also a tag barrage one jump jet enough heat sinking to take care of everything but the medium lasers uh, which we shouldn't really worry, worry too much about. Guardian ECM, we put a fire control system advanced in this thing. Um, I didn't really have a um, anything better, like a, a uh, AC uh, fire control system, but it does have breaching shots, so we can split the rotaries up on two different uh, opponents and do full damage on each of them, which is going to be a bonus. Uh, regular cockpits, I didn't really have anything else better to put in. I put the ranged sensors in this thing because this rack has only got a 480 uh, or 420 range. It'll be 10% more with this, 10% more with uh, uh, but the battle computer range, so plus 20% range. So over range about, about 500 meters or so, plus the pilot gets an extra 10% range, so maybe 550 meters, which is still pretty good. We got the battle computer tracking in to ignore evasion pips, the ballistic to give us plus one to hit and a medium range they give us better sh chances at medium range i didn't really have anything else to to uh put in there i would have put extended or longer range in there if i could but i, I didn't really have it so um yeah xl engine we dropped in one jump jet um and that's about it we've got uh is it two tons yeah two tons of um uh rack 10 caseless for 40 rounds which i think because we're not going to be firing this at full um a uh, a full bore because of the recoil on this thing so most likely we'll be firing four shots per maybe three four shots per so that's enough for 10 turns of firing here um yeah four shots per yeah 10 turn, 10 turns of firing and then the rack 20 has got 48 rounds and if this thing fires at four we got 12 turns of firing so you know not as many turns of firing as i'd like to have but it should be pretty good but we're going to run this today and give this a shot and see how it works out um Goofy's mech we changed very very so very very slightly um, where are you here so we had to replace the ATM 9 which I did and then what I did is I pulled up the regular tag because we were having problems with heat I thought I'd just work on it a little bit more so I pulled out the tag that was here we had a regular Guardian ECM so I switched it for a clan Guardian ECM put in some patchwork materials and I was able to get a plus two engine heat sink uh, in the center here dropped a little bit of back armor and we should be pretty good heat wise here 78 78 so hopefully we're not going to be overheating um, that additional tag wasn't doing a ton but you know didn't need to really be there okay so let's give this uh, Atlas a try I don't know how I don't know what to expect with it uh, it can if we need to have it um, do a lot of damage in a short period of time we certainly can do that uh, but let's just try it out. All right, so we're gonna drop into a mission here. Let's go to the command center And I thought we would take this one. I think this is probably the hardest mission on the planet 
right now it is the redirection mission clan wolf versus uh, sorry, Clan J. Falcon versus Clan Wolf escort in the Badlands. We already kind of did these one, where we had uh, five lances, or sorry, four lances uh, facing off against us. So twenty against eight early on in the in the uh, match. So we're going to take this one again just to see how we do. And let's go full salvage because we're going to need it, I think, for C bills at the end. And let's get our second lance into play, the Zeus, the new Atlas, and we're going to run. Um, what do we want to run now? That's the question. Let's put Gundal, Mastodon, and Workhorse. We definitely need the this guy in here. I wonder if we want to go with the Archer or maybe try out the Naga. Having the extra arrow and AMS. Although I don't know. Maybe we bring the Orion again, rather than going with the Archer. Let's try that. He's got a lot of lasers. I'm just worried about ammunition on this one. Um, and having the direct fire might be more helpful. Yeah, let's go this route. Okay, here it comes. Oh, it's a little different this time. All right. All right, well, this should be really fun. 20 against 8 at the start. We do. We fight over a place like this. All right, let's get forward. we got to identify any carriers or anything early and get rid of them as fast as we can. Um... I'm going to send you this way because we're going to be choked going up this hill here. Let's send you around the same way. So I think we'll get Workhorse to activate the enemy or activate the convoy. Do 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 do. Do 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 do. No, you're not. They are. They're under lots of heavy fire. Let's get your asteroid up here. Okay. Up there. I'm really interested to see how this this uh, rack atlas, the rat the ratless does. Commander? Rackless. It's gonna be several turns before it's in battle, though. Got a bottleneck of a hundred tonners here. Okay, we got a bleep. Looks like an exterminator. Yep. Well, they're pretty quick. Got to be careful when we come around this corner. Better have more than one mech round that corner at the same time, because if we don't, Somebody's going to get shredded. Another exterminator. Uh-huh. Is this guy self-propelled already? Drop a few rounds on him. Get your asteroid, where are you? Get your asteroid into here. Alright, they're starting to show up now. What do we got over here? Long Tom? Dire Wolf? Is that a Lone Wolf? W. Q. 
Carrier, Highlander, Atlas II, another carrier, um, another Dire Wolf, Lone Wolf. Okay, let's, uh, oof, this guy's got a lot of hit points. Let's take the best chance we have to hit here. Atlas isn't bad. Let's go on this guy. Because then we can put the two... Uh, nice. Then we can put the two uh, arrows over there too. Oof, not enough of our, for a kill. Good damage, though. I think the arrow should drop into here, though. Yep. Yeah, so they got they got 20 guys. They've got a lock on me. We're only seeing a little over half of them too. Waiting for orders. Ooh. You may think I'm crazy, but I need to kill this carrier right here. Let's go after the carrier and dialing it up. Fire. Beautiful. Vehicle down. You got that right. Okay, who do we got next? Dallas Infiltrator, Gundal. Looks like it's about it. Workhorse. Waiting for orders. You could probably stand here the whole battle for crying out loud. Not enough to kill, huh? Trying to save the Inferno rounds from when we need to shut people down. Don't know if we killed the long time on that though. Ow! I can't take much more of this. Not much armor left in that location. Yeah, no shit. We gotta start tearing these guys a new one. Ooh, beautiful. Hit your own guys. I think that was the Long Tom. Long Tom shooting his own guys. Okay, Infiltrator's got to go next. Don't think we can get close enough to shoot anybody. Actually, I'm considering moving them this way. Start targeting the guys over here. Okay, another vehicle moving. Damn it. Warning, heavy damage. Yeah, they're trying to get rid of you. Warning, armor low. Got another SP vehicle back here. I can't take much more of this. That one was a bad one right there. 
Dial it back, guys. You're pissing me off. Another vehicle. All right, let's go screw somebody up. That's the Highlander. That's the Atlas. Wow. That's insane, the chances to hit, guys, at this range. That's a good on the Highlander. I, we could probably kill this guy straight out if we try to CT him. Atlas has got the long fire, though. Uh, it's either pull the Atlas leg off or kill the Exterminator. I think it's going to be kill the Exterminator. Let's just see if we can remove this guy from the battle. Firing. See ya. God, that's got to be scary as shit for a pilot. That's probably going to be Ultra 10 only. Let's get you over here. Get to within striking distance next turn. Now the question is, is do we move the other dashy over the other side? Ow. My armor is peeling away. Yeah. They're banging through my armor. My armor's getting stripped off. That was a bad one, that one. No, I think we need to get her up here. Reporting. Major armor loss. Christ, that guy sounds like my brother. Now later stages of my, my brother's life where he had a really had a hard time talking. Because of his arthritis, his jaw was so sore, he was always talking like this. Major armor loss. They got a lot of artillery vehicles we got to deal next deal with next turn. We're in the right positions, I think, for it. This is this a Mars vehicle? Looks like a Mars. Okay, at least he's only got a Gauss rifle. Long time we should be able to pull down. Hopefully Goofy can take it down. We got a Puma back here. Another artillery. There's a carrier here. So we got three three definite artillery vehicles. Four. Wait, what was that? Rack two? Ultra twos? Direwolf B. Okay. Not so worried about the Pegasus. All right, people, let's go fuck some shit up. Moving. Okay, a pair of Marses. Solitaire. Oh shit, this is the uh, stone rhino, huh? Yep, let's go this route, see if we can get both these. Nicely done. Not a kill, but significant damage. Fried a lot of those guys in there.
I'm going to do that because we're going to sprint after this. Let's drop you. Switching to Inferno, firing. And we got our CT and our right side, so let's back up and just kind of face the left over. Okay, what's next? Don't know how badly hurt this artillery vehicle is. The Stone Rhino is the next target after we get rid of these artillery artillery and and uh, other vehicles here. Orders. Oof, he's got a lot of armor, eh? Copy that. Not anymore, he doesn't. Not anymore, he doesn't. Okay. I have a feeling the infiltrator is woefully out of position here. But if he can take these guys on and have them out of the battle, tie them up, that'll be a job well done. Okay, what do we got back here? We got a carrier still, and this artillery vehicle. And the Puma, I think, has got artillery too, if I'm not mistaken. What's this guy? Another dire wolf. Yes, Commander. Gonna warlord this to get a better chance to hit. And drop the shiz on him. Here it comes. Okay, a little bit of damage. Move back into AMS range here. Okay, so what do we got left here? Infiltrator Dallas, Gundal, Mastodon. Okay, four left. He's nice and toasty. So you get a fire, that's the question. Are you gonna fire? Nope. Still want that night gear. Slight damage, Commander. I don't blame you. Wait, was that this guy or was it this guy? W, that's the lone wolf. They got three dire wolves, which means we can get one dire wolf out of this. For sure. That's a huge sale for us if we sell it. If, we get, if we're lucky, we can get a stone rhino. That much. Still plenty. Oof. All right, well, let's just fire on this guy. Firing on well, that was a whole lot of nothing. Let's get some height.
OP the Atlas. Come on. Nice hits. Enemy mech. Critical damage detected. Not enough for a knockdown though. Let's give them something a little more to shoot for on this side. Save some armor for my main line guys. A little on the edge of the AMS range, but that's fine. This may not have been the best mission to test out these racks on, but uh, it is the mission we're going to test them on. We may push that stone rhino with the racks and see how much damage we can do here. All right, Gundal. Let's show them what we got. Everything is in range. Go to four. Well, that just actually dropped the chances to hit. No, it didn't. Let's leave the medium lasers off. Or do we turn them back on again? Can we use them with the... Oh, yeah. That's fine. All right. Let's put everything on the stone rhino. Yeah, that was kind of underwhelming. How much damage did we do? I have no, mo no idea. Not a lot of hits though, I think. Come on, Dallas, you got to get out there. Hang it in there. It's a good thing Hellion's fast. Yes, Commander. All right. Where's that stone rhino? Dire wolf. Oh, there he is there. Oof, that's a good chance to hit. We'll take that. Did that? Was that all three hits? One of them looked like it went off in the middle of nowhere. Alright, you need to fire him back up, girl. Okay, we did penetrate. Should be able to drop that stone rhino, I think. Hopefully the next turn. I think Hellion's rack is still up. If it is, we're just going to hammer it on that guy. He's on the edge of the map board. Can't really go anywhere else. Yeah. Right, she's going on 22. Someone's going on 29, though. Whoever the hell that is, that's fast. Probably this solitaire, whatever the hell this is. Nope. Exterminator, I guess it was going? Twenty-five? What's this guy back here? Hellbringer. There's four direwolves, right? Or three? Three, three direwolves. Commander. Warlord. Hey, what's up? That was a critical hit. Location confirmed. 
Beautiful. They laid off this guy last turn. Let's see if we can get lucky and claim uh, one of the two vehicles here. Got a building. I don't don't think we got the vehicle though. Watch my heat. I'm taking damage. Yep. Awaiting orders. Did this guy die? I have no idea. Fifty percent, huh? I understand. Let's go over here. Come on, direct fire first, please. There you go. We in range for HE? Nope. Gonna use the barrage on this guy though. Yeah, so his whole torso's gone. CT is heavily hit. And firing. Reporting. Critical hit. Nicely done. He's a little toasty over there. God, the destruction. Look at this. The wonton destruction. I know there's mentioned several times of uh, putting flamers on mechs, but really with these battles, you can't do it. That means you got to get close and could you imagine? Can you imagine getting in close to these guys? Right now they, they can't only use their long-range weapons. But like if we had if we you know getting in close would just be a nightmare for us. They just shred us for sure. All right, firing on this guy. Oh yeah. Is he going down? Oh, he's done. Didn't explode, so there might be three pieces of that. I wanted to put the spall liner on this atlas, but um, I didn't have the space. <laughs> All right, not so bad. As long as it's not a direct hit. Yeah. All I hear from my team is complaints. Have a seat, buddy. You look tired. There you go. Just lie down right there. There you are. Let's get back over into AMS range if we can. There you go. Uh, wow. Sure. I copy. Couple points. Couple of points. What's this guy? Is that a carrier? There's two Mars vehicles back here, but what the hell is this guy? It is. Okay. I'm receiving you. Let 
Minefield on the way. No jump jets here today. We'll walk over this way and take a whole 14 points damage. Holy shit. Let's see if we can shut this guy up. Oof, only one hit, really? Down to 104. Who do we have left? Gundal. We could walk it up, try to wreck that guy. Might be able to do it. Might be able to do it. How are you doing? Pretty darn good. Arm is pretty damn low though. This arm is okay because this is where the rack 10 is. I got two extras so if we lose the rack 10 we're fine. I don't have another rack 20 so can't lose that. All right, we're all under heavy fire. Trying to give them plenty of targets to shoot for. We're going to sprint uh, Infiltrator up the hill next turn. Lots of armor. Just relax. Yes, come in. Fear is the mind killer. Both racks have not jammed yet. Let's get rid of our arty vehicle here if we can. Not bad chances to hit. Let's leave these off. Nicely done. This thing gets in close on somebody. They're fucked. Especially if I wind those racks up, man. I only have four right now. The rack 20 is only hitting for 80 per shot, though. But still, four times 80 is pretty damn good if you hit with all four of them. I mean, we could pull off the, uh, the rack 10, put a heavy MM... Um, MRM on there, or a pair of, maybe we might be able to get a pair of heavy MRMs on there. It just all comes down to weight, right? Yeah. Guy's being a jerk. Who do they have left? Oh, we're on the next phase, 27. Okay. So what do they got here? Three... Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, right? Five, eight, nine, ten, fourteen. So we've only taken out six, really? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So they got thirteen left. Thirteen. Might be able to take this Atlas out this turn. Two points. Okay. Who do we want? Carrier? I think we're handling the missiles pretty good here. Lone Wolf probably. I think this exterminator's got some good EMS. 
or AMS, sorry. Once I take down that uh, Atlas, I'll have to kill this guy. Okay, Mastodon, let's get up the hill. How far can you get up here? Beautiful. Let's get some height. Take some damage. Target this guy. Firing. Yeah. It's like we're spitting on him. We only got one arrow this turn. That guy's going to get it. I'm showing minor damage. Standing by. You deserve a break today. Enjoy the heat, buddy. Can't take the heat, don't get in the kitchen. You know what I'm saying? Now we're cooking with gas. I think we should drop some Hydra on him too. Don't think we penetrated anywhere, but warm him up. Hopefully he won't fire next turn. See if we can get a quick strike and a kill on this guy. Beautiful. Guns off the field. I even feel like Goofy's mech is like underwhelming now. The ATM builds nice, but if it can't get close, it's useless, right? I find I'm waiting for the assaults to move it up move up and up to be able to do anything. At least they're absorbing the damage. Ready for orders. Let's drop one Hydra. Really? Oh, with, oh man, it's the AMS is going off, that's why. Yeah, mess is in overtime on this guy. I wonder if we can get the heat dissipating armor in this thing. I don't think it's clan though, so we'd have to up the case on both sides to case whatever it is. Good to go. In your sphere case. Nothing's jammed yet. Oof. That's probably going to be our target. I mean, that guy would be dead, but this is really the threat. And firing. Oh yeah, I forgot the Ultra 10 is like a, like a flak 10. So it doesn't do just regular 10 damage, it's like 3 times 5 times whatever. Alright, let's get into position up here. OP this Atlas, he's not moving, so let's take advantage of it. Engaging target. See ya. Enemy mech destroyed. 
Seriously, I should just make more direwolves exactly like this guy. This this build, the laser build is insane. It's a good thing a lot of the components that I've got in this thing are exceedingly rare, like the fire control system predator. Because if they were common, uh, all my mechs would have it. Who do we got left here? Dallas? Is that the Pegasus that was firing? Yeah. How badly, we don't know how badly damaged that guy is. I'm here. It's the lone wolf. We could just try and core him or we could take his torso off. Or we could just shoot him. Really great chances to hit. Let's just shoot him. Let the chips fall where they may. There's the knockdown, so he's pretty much done next turn. Yeah, we got our firing line of five assaults now. Well, four assaults and heavy. Orion might as well be an assault. Warning. Enemy sensor lock detected. It's phase 26. At least we all get to move. Uh Confirm. Let me think about this one for a second. Yeah. They shot down all my missiles? That's that exterminator. Can someone take care of that exterminator for me for crying out loud? Who's up next? Goofy, he's got missiles, so that's not going to happen. Although this guy's fired. Is AMS, so maybe it'll happen. Waiting for orders. Yeah, let's not go this route. Let's just get these guys into AMS range. Go after this guy. Uh, Warlord it. Really low chance to hit with this rack, man. I'm telling you. CTM. Thank you. Alright, what's next? Rack is jammed, okay. Well, that guy just committed suicide. They got a lock on me. It's alright girl, he just he committed suicide. Yes, Commander.
Let's take this guy out the field. He tried to help you. This guy tried to stay alive, but he died because he's an idiot. Targeting rear armor. Enemy mech destroyed. Who's the king of the battlefield? Who's the king of the battlefield? Oh, okay. Who's this guy? What the Hellbringer? There's another dire wolf back there. So there's four of them. Okay. Unless that was the guy that... Did he move from over here? One, two... I guess so. I guess he's been moving across here. Whatever. Ready for orders. On the move. On the move. Full speed. You know what? Let's just do this. Get our heat back. So they got eight guys left. Two dire wolves, exterminator, hellbringer, puma, the carrier, and two um Mars vehicles. Guess I was lucky that time. Bring it, fucker. Good thing the last two legs of this uh, journey are going to be relatively easy. Well, easier. Let's hope. Come on, figure out what you're doing. Who do we have next here? So Goofy went. Dallas and Gundal, eh? Beautiful, they all hit. Affirmative. Ready for order. Okay, I'm on it. Hey, you know what this exterminator can't do? Use its AMS against this. Try shooting that down, buddy. All right, there's another guy gone. Another one bites the dust. Hey, we're going to kill you too. Okay, so who's going against what next turn? We don't have anybody left, right? No. So we'll get Infiltrator probably on the vehicles. These guys have got some nasty weapons. Receiving you. 60 Hydra rounds, eh? Could make this guy nice and toasty. That's all we can shoot at anyway. Oh no, we could hit the Puma. That would probably be a kill. Let's go after the Puma. One more for the trash heap. You got that right. 
Get that AMS up here. This guy's the guy that's engaged, so let's go after him. Look at that chance to hit. Keep that pressure up on this guy. Going down, beautiful. Okay, what do we got next? Beautiful. Oh, we can see like everybody on this field. Engaging target. Oh, we missed too. We had good chances to hit, man. Well, maybe next turn. So Gundal, hopefully you can push, well, maybe the Hellbringer now. Could be a shred on the Hellbringer if we get close enough. Oh, he's the one that's got the uh, sniper. They don't like me at no, they don't. These guys don't like any of us. See if we can get a kill on this guy. Ultra 20. I think I'd be happy to swap out the, uh, the, the both of the, um, the racks for the pair of Ultra 20s. My armor's getting ripped off. That guy can throw a lot of shit into the battle, that's for sure. Go this route. Well, oh, penetrated, but not a kill. Oh shit! Shot our own guy in the back. How can we shoot our own guy in the back from up here? Thought we were way high enough. Of course, it's got to be a CT strike. Because what else would it be? Roger that. Full speed. Okay, let's make that dire wolf toasty. The pair of infernos, here it comes. Hope it's nice and warm over there for you guys. So there's another Mars vehicle back there somewhere. Only one got through. Not bad. Not bad at all. I 
Let's make it interesting and activate. I think so. Let's make this interesting. We're going to activate the... Uh, this turn we're going to activate the convoy. Wow, well, we actually go before the enemy. Let's go with Artemis. And just fire. Lots of landmines, explosions. Okay, Goofy, I want you to push these guys back corner. I'm going to confirm the vigilance because we're going to sprint it up. Ooh, 30% only though. Looks like it's going to be Dire Wolf most likely. Yep, here it comes. Is he going down? Yep. It's going to be it for him. Time for a little bit of, oh, no Warlord. No Warlord. Don't have the juice. Uh, yeah. Oh, the medium laser hit, beautiful. Beautiful. Getting kills even without your big gun, gotta love that. Barrage on, Warlord, Mars Assault Vehicle, firing. He's going down. Oh shit, really? Dude! Heat damage. Damn it. You put it right at your goddamn feet. Yes, Get over here. Oh, we got some shooting too, buddy. We got shooting. A couple of Inferno arrows over on these guys. I'm receiving you. Got it. Full speed, no Come on, take out the Mars vehicle. Please hit with the big gun. Well, you hit with it, but you didn't kill it. Just fire on this guy. Wow. See ya. Now, can we jump down? Yep, down here. Beautiful. We like I said we're going to activate. I'm crazy that way. All right, here comes some shots on this Hellbringer. Don't know about this atlas. Don't know if it's worth it. I mean, that was some good damage, but just like pepper spray, though, really.
They got three left. Just look at all his weapons. How hot is he, though? Don't know. Oh, he's pretty damn. Look at that. He's almost shut down. He sure as hell ain't doing anything this turn. Okay. Far away. Hanging in there. What do you need? Though we probably got guys up ahead of us too. Yep. Warhawk, 85 tons, okay. That looks like a stealth bomber to me. Yep. Nidhogg, yep. Spicing things up a little bit. Alright, let's fire on this guy. We gotta get rid of this vehicle. Okay, three hits on the side. Should be able to clean that up. Don't get too far ahead. Turn the battlefield slightly. Okay. Come on, move forward. Do it, do it, do it. Oh, they're not moving. Okay. Could have been this guy back here that was trapped. All right, Nidhogg moving forward. Gotta try and kill that stealth bomber. Okay, keep moving, guys, keep moving. What do we got left here? Duck next, Hellion. No. Yeah. Duck and Hellion. Where is Duck? He's back here. Better move his ass up here. He's got to head to uh, get some AMS on those that convoy. Head to get some AMS on the convoy. Cause we got a little convoy trucking through the night. You know it would be much tougher if there was like only one lance at the start and then four lances and you had to get the convoy through four lances of guys. <laughs> or one lance at the start, or two lances at the start of really tough guys. Then the next round is three lances of like heavies where you gotta try and push the vehicles through and then the last is once the first vehicle goes out two more lances of assaults or heavies or a lance of assault and a lance of heavy shows up. So seven lances total, two, three, and two. That would be a really good fight, I think. Waiting for order. Okay, getting the AMS over here. We're on fire, so let's just uh, do that. Cool off a little bit. Commander. Can you Shrek this guy for me, please? Can you she-wreck this guy? Uh, let's turn this off. Well, no, we got Warlord. Need this vehicle gone. Please do that for me. Look at that thing fly off into nowhere. Okay.
Oh, come on. Cool off a little bit. Yes, Commander. How you feeling today? A little hot, are we? Let's leave both these guys off. We'll hammer this guy with the ATMs. Start on the stealth bomber. They're sure he took damage. All right, what do we got here? Nidhog, pretty low. Hellbringer. There goes his whole side. Enemy mech. Critical damage detected. Look, it's not my fault he sucks. Not my fault you suck, buddy. Hammer him. Reporting critical hit. Panicked, yeah, you think? Ready for order. Let's split fire on these guys. Like that. Here it comes. God, this thing's a murderer. Although I do have to say I'm glad I put those range extenders on it. Because if we didn't have those, that could be severe problems. Stealth bomber, please. Wow, we're like running low on stuff here. I know he's got, uh, I know he's got AMS, but we got to do it. Okay, Rack is back. Okay, who do we got back here? Timberwolf. Prime. Probably somebody else over here, or down over here. It's nice that they're all full armor now. Everything that we're fighting is full armor. It's beautiful. Stealth bomber figuring out what to do now. Either that it's the Nidhogg. I think it's the bomber. Oh, I don't know who it was, but Ready for order. not doing a goddamn thing. Let's sprint first. Not very far, is it? Well, it gets most of the vehicles under the AMS. Okay, who do we got back here? Cascatel, okay. Yep, shoot the stealth bomber. Okay, good damage. Reporting critical hit. Thank you. Standing by. On my way. Um, what do we got? See if we can get a kill on this guy. Get our heat down too. 
Here it comes. Gone. There's his guns. Okay. Let's not let this stealth bomber shoot. Firing. That's it for him. Finally, we're in the water. We can cool off a little bit. Yes, we got the AMS within range. Beautiful. Okay, Goofy, where are you? Uh, let's hold off on the HE. We can't, I don't think we can get a kill anyway. Oh, we might have. Uh, let's fire first. Engaging target. See ya. Enemy unit destroyed. And we can get in the water. Beautiful. Cool off. Nice. Yes, Commander. All right. Can't see anybody. Sprint forward. They're down to three up here. Oh, they're down to two, I mean. All the aircraft are down. Come on, guys. Decide what you're doing. This is the guy that got to follow. That might be too far. Yeah, we're doing okay with recoil. I guess because the pilot's got minus two recoil. Where the fuck are you going? It's always one vehicle that doesn't want to go anywhere. Where are you going? I guess they can't get through? Commander. Well, my AMS is completely out of ammo. No shooting. Just running. Looks like I'm an LRM boat now. Firing. Here you go. Warlord's not back yet, but that's fine. Yes, Full speed. So we got two Inferno left? Let's hang on to them. Target confirmed. Beautiful. All right, firing. I think I hit something. It's going to still fight, eh? All right. Uh, 
I hope our vehicles actually move forward. Okay, he was the guy that activated, so let's move him over here and see if these guys in the back move forward. Pot shot. Target's taking a critical hit. He's running too. Do we have Dallas left? Is that it? She's back here. They don't have jump jets, so well. We better be careful these vehicles don't get out before we got enough guys up there. Is that a knockdown? Nope. It's a kill. Beautiful. Okay, he finally came back. Beautiful. I was afraid he wasn't going to move forward. All right, Hellion. Commander. What do you got? You got six turns of rack fire left. Better start rationing that. Maximum speed. Just go with three for now. Firing. Soften that guy's face up a little bit not get uh, to a position where we might shoot our own person in the back like you got shot in the back oh uh, yeah how much do we have left here just go with three Roger. Orders. On it. okay keep the AMS well it doesn't matter now the AMS is gone so gonna say keep it close by but it'll make a difference let's hope uh, the mechs that show up aren't uh, heavy uh, missile mechs Full we're a little close but that's fine Nice. Is that a knockdown? No. Standing by. Roger. What do you think, Dallas? Simple. Oof. All right. Well, can't have everything. Failed to connect. Yeah, it's all right. That's all right. Got plenty more to go. Guys, keep moving. Yes, Commander. Confirm. Oh yeah, that's pretty good. Firing. I understand. Christ, he's still going. That hit something good. Receiving. I'm dead. How much ammo do you got? Not much. Two laser hits and he's still going. That's a critical hit. He's not even falling down either. There you go. Good to go. 
All right, guys, when I get the first vehicle out, uh, I will cut back in. All right, here we go, guys. Here comes the dropship. I'm kind of in okay position here, I think. Hold this position, Commander. The package will be on Another Timberwolf. Let's just get into here for now. Okay. What do we got? Got a linebacker? Yes, Commander. Black Knight. Timberwolf. Orion. Linebacker. And Dire Wolf, Lone Wolf. The Lone Wolf McQuaid. All right, well, this should be interesting. They're in a kill box, so we should do okay here. A little lower on the dire wolf, but I think the dire wolf is really the guy we want to take on here. Ah, a little bit behind him with the uh, tag. The Baraji. The vehicles have been moving pretty good. Actually kind of shocked at how well they're kind of staying together here. It's not moving fast, that's all. Okay, here we go. Round 17. Let's see how we do. We're running low on ammo with a few guys here, so there's only five of them. Let's hope we can burn through them quickly. Enemy turn, probably linebacker, if I was to guess. Or a Timberwolf, maybe. Black Knight. Don't know who that was. Yes, One ton of Hydra left. Let's use it up. Just cycle through here. Oh, the linebacker is the one that went, so let's use it on him. Spread a little heat around. I'm out of long -range missiles. We still got two Inferno rounds left. If we can get Workhorse to go, we can drop them right on the, right on that uh, linebacker. He's going on 18 though, so the most likely those guys will move out of there before then. I want to get Hellion to crest the hill, but it doesn't look like we have much support initiative-wise. Let's do it this way. Just going to use three rounds. Okay, nice. Tag was a good spot, even if we hit or not. Good position. Alright, they got to figure out what they're going to do here. Apparently a lot of, a whole lot of nothing it looks like. Well, Timberwolf. Yep. Firing. I think they're probably trying to blow some heat off here. That's why they're not doing anything. Timberwolf strike, I think, probably. 
Does it really matter? Well, we might be able to kill the uh, timber wolf here. Guard a critical hit. Going down. Okay. Receiving you. On my way. This guy hasn't moved yet. That's why he's so hard to hit. Go after the linebacker. Gonna wind up the rack. Warlord it. I'm on it. Okay, some nice shredding down there. Looks like the arm came off. Solid connection on that one. Okay, you got two vehicles out. Well, linebacker seems to be in the center of them, so. Oh, man. Target's taking a critical hit. I'm out of long range missiles. Those guys are burning. Do we have one barrage left? I think we do. We have it on, uh, on Gundal. This guy's got the uh, rotary bore. Oh man, I better shoot this guy. Although... Try and torso him. I don't know if you saw that, but uh, even though with my offensive push, it still stayed at 99%. That's crazy. They're standing in the sea of fire. Okay, three out. They just don't know what to do here. So who's left? We got Gundal on 15. This guy still hasn't gone yet, I don't think. Let's fire on the linebacker. Here it comes. I don't think that dire wolf's gonna shoot. Things are just way too toasty for him now. He's got a long heat bar, but it's over the it's over the red line. So is this guy? No, he's still gonna do it. Yeah. I tried to stop him from shooting. I really did. Wow, you got that Orion got shredded. Commander. Um Are we going to take that from him? I copy. Yeah, I think you know what I'm saying. Was a 
critical hit. Order. Fuck this guy. Uh, I don't know how many guys you killed. You got the linebacker and the uh, mad cat. Or the uh, timber wolf. Ready for order. We don't take shit from these guys. You get one chance to shoot and that's it, buddy. Alright, here it comes. That's even with an offensive push. Look at that chance to hit. It's crazy. Engaging target. Enemy mech. Critical damage detected. Yes, Commander. Alright, let's see if we can core this guy. There it is, folks. Alright, well, that was fun. Now all I gotta do is wait for these vehicles to get out and we're done. There's four. You almost fell down, but not quite. Okay, so I think we're we're probably pretty good with ammo here. I think everybody's sort of made out really well with the ammo on this. Come on, vehicle, roll out of here. I want to go home. Come on. You're going 17. Let's go. There it is. Commander. We'll see you guys later. Oh my goodness, that was a good fight. Uh, you better not have crashed. Okay, there we go. Beautiful. Successful. Okay, guys, contract payment increased by 50%. This will not cover our damages, but, you know, I think that's, I think we did pretty well here. Yeah, that, uh, yeah, the Mast Mastodon took a massive amount of damage right at the very end there. That Rappelgore did fire off on him. What, wasn't much we could do about it. And this was from me, unfortunately, but, uh, yeah. All right, let's see what we got here. So we need sea bills, big time sea bills. So we're gonna have a look at components. I need tracker sensors. Um, we got two Atlas two parts. Dire Wolf B exterminator linebackers. Uh, Orion one stone rhino part. Okay. Timberwolf, Warhawks, Black Knight parts, Direwolf, Lone Wolf, Direwolf AP. Huh. This variant has some weird experimenter, experimental rotary weapon system designed to delete infantry units. Oh, that's the uh, Rappel. Rappel Gabor, whatever it is. Probably. Alright, let's have a look down here. Just to see if there's anything we want. Clan Goss Rifles. Hopefully we get those in the draw, but I'm not taking any. Laser AMSs would be nice, but... Not essential at this moment. Here's these uh, rotary 
uh, AP large bore Gauss rifles. Which we have. Okay, about a computer stuff. Nice. Chameleon. So much stuff here. Excels, clan Excels, ex three clan exchanges at a group. Targeting computers. Feral Lamellar. Immune to through armor criticals and damage. That's a really good possibility. Uh, wow, heat sinks quantity 17. Okay, heat sink kits, patchworks, powered sensors. Does not look like. Well, that's a possibility. If we're going to keep the atlas the way it is, that's a possibility right there. And not much else down here. Ultra Auto Cannon 20, which I don't think there's no Ultra 20 up here. Feral Lamellar would be nice. How many slots does it use up? Six. It's not much. Plus 20% structure points, minus 20% armor, plus 0.88 armor points multiplier. It's pretty heavy. Yeah. My problem is now I just have no idea what uh, what I want here. Uh, let's see the dire wolf parts. We could go straight up sea bills. There's five dire world parts right there. Got Hellbringer. Got one Hellbringer part, so it's kind of useless. And then maybe Feral Lamellar. So much stuff left in the battlefield. But I mean, we can go back and, and like, there's plenty of missions to come. But right now, we just need sea bills. I've got to get the Kaiju up, Kaiju up and running. This is probably the best way to do it, too. I should really take both of these. Uh, let's just go this route. All right. Uh, what else do we get? Timberwolf part. Pair of clan Gauss rifles. Okay. Large heavy lasers. That's that's not bad. We can always use those. Medium ER pulse. Okay, that gives us two of those. Oh man, we got ripped off here. Look at this. It's like nothing. Heat sinks plus two. That's kind of nice. Real heat sink kit. Double. Oh, we got the weapon mounts. Okay, so that's sad. Fusion cores. Okay, so we got a lot of sea bills out of this. Okay, let's have a look here. Okay, not too bad in damages. Not too bad. We lost a bit of sea bills on that, but we made a ton in the stuff that we got out of this mission. So let's have a look at those dire wolves and see what we're going to put together here. So we already had the lone wolf. Come on. Okay. Mech bay. So we have the lone wolf. Dire Wolf B. So the lone, this was the lo Lone Wolf AP, right? This was the one that had that, uh, yeah, those got, uh, rotary Gauss rifles, which we still have, and we're not using because they're short, so short range. They would have been no good in that first battle. Um, okay, so let's have a look here. 
Yeah, look at this, man. Uh, that's the vulture we can put together. Lone wolf. Just a regular lone wolf. Shoulder mounted twin LRM 20 launchers with 24 racks. Swarm LRMs backed up by Gauss rifle in the left arm. Carry a medium pulse laser and a stubby LBX out of cannon 20 with 10 cluster rounds. That's not too bad. The Z is what? Oh, that's the Timberwolf. Uh, WM. Long range ERPPC backed up by large pulse laser mounted in each arm. Three ER medium lasers, ER small, ultra auto cannon 20. So that's probably the one we want to put together if we want an ultra 20. That's the replicable bore one that we already have. Dire Wolf B. 300 XL. Are these all 300 XL? Probably, huh? Doesn't say. I'm guessing they're all 300s. So the Ultra 20 version is... Uh, which one? Or calm uh, Chris and Dashy doesn't say what this one has on it. Okay, well let's go for that's the LBX twenty. This is the is this the one with the Ultra twenty? Yeah. So let's ready this guy. And let's use, we're going to put two of these together, I guess, eh? Really expensive if we go this way. Uh, it's the cheapest. This one, this one. Confirm. Okay, and let's put the other one together. It's two dashies, man. It's crazy. Uh, we'll put this one together. It's the cheapest. Alright, let's see what we got here. We can assemble Timberwolf too. And a Vulture. But we're going to leave those for now. See, it makes me want to like just... Like, maybe keep this guy, I don't know, ditched. Ah. It's such a hard choice, you know? When you get stuff like this, it's like, now I got all these 100-ton mechs, and I, I don't... I should just trash them. Yeah, rotary AP Goss. This guy doesn't have much left on him. Plus two heat sink kit, beautiful. Clan heat sinks. Um, slick sweet. Some patchwork. Yeah, some patchwork, some more ammo. Okay, so we, let's just get rid of this guy. We've already got a lone wolf. So let's ditch you. If you let me do it. Oh, it's got a built-in Nova CEWS though too, right? What about this guy? Hope he's got his Ultra 20 left. Find out in a second. ERPPCs. Ultra 20 ammo, but no Ultra 20. Uh, the other mech is better than this one. This is a 300 core. Hard points are about the same, like 30-30 across the board, right? This is the same, right? No, it's got less. Let's just see here. I mean, this one's got the built-in Nova CEWS. The, the core is the same size. 
it's got stealth fire control system hag uh, we got we picked up two goss rifles too all right let's ditch the other one keep this guy it's clearly the better of the two Wow, this scraps for 8 million. This scraps for 8 million. Wow, we got sea bills to put the kaiju together. <laughs> All we need is a Clan XL engine. Oh, yeah, we got one in here already. That's right, I put it in. I put the Clan XL in here already. So now it's just tricking this guy out and tricking this guy out. Oh man, we got too many heavy mechs now. I just maybe we just I don't know. Do we go all hundred tonners? We just do it. You know what we're gonna do? Just so you guys can see me doing it. Uh enemy four strength warlord. Hardest it can be. There's nothing else they can do to crank up the difficulty here. That's fine. Cranking it up. It's at max now. So that's what it's going to be from now on. We're going to keep the 100 ton max. Work on them. Drop some guys out of the lineup. Um, we got enough C-bills for the financial report. It's costing us 3.5 million now a month. Oh, well, with missions like that, we can't, you know, we're going to be getting lots of sea bills, so I'm not that worried about it. Okay, guys, I'm going to end this episode here. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did drop a like, if you haven't subscribed, please feel free to subscribe. You can also drop any comments in the comment section down below. Until next time, we'll see you later.